Hello, my name is Anouk. I am a professional circus artist and yoga practitioner. Today I'm going to guide you through an upper body release. We're going to focus mostly on upper back release. You can sit cross-legged on a mat or on a blanket, get comfortable. Bring your hands on your side. Take a moment here to think about relaxing your shoulder muscle. Then gently turn your head from one side creating half circles to the other side. Okay, now bring the fingers of the left hand towards you, then bring your right arm up, grab the side of your head and pull gently to feel a stretch in your neck area. Continue to focus on your breath here so your muscle can relax. On the next exhale, bring it down. Then let's do the same thing on the other side, so fingers towards you, gently pull on the side of your head. Try to keep your shoulder down when you're doing this exercise. On the next exhale, bring it down. Now let's interlace our finger and place it behind our head. Bring your elbows towards you and without pushing too hard on your head, round your back, bring your chin towards your chest. And on the next inhale, bring it back up. And we're going to alternate like this, rounding through the back. So you can feel the stretch in the upper back and then going back to straight position. Stretch your arms up, keeping your fingers interlaced. And then push it down. Let's now interlace them again. Roll your shoulder back, open your chest. Head is slightly up. Inhale here. Exhale, bring it down. Okay, great. We're now going to learn the eagle pose, which is a yoga pose. So let's bring our hands in front of us, palm facing each other. Then bend your elbow and bring one elbow on top of the other one. Now cross your arms and you want the palm of your hands to join, if possible. In this position, bring your shoulders down and bring your elbows away from you and slightly round your back. You should feel it in your trapeze and in your upper back. Release and now let's do it on the other side. So bend your elbows and bring the other elbow on top of it. Shoulders are low, elbows away from you. Release, and now we're going to get in a tabletop position. So your shoulder should be aligned with your wrist, and your hip should be aligned with your knee. Now tuck your toes in. On the next inhale, let your stomach go towards the floor. Hips are lifting. Exhale, round your back. Push on the floor 
And we're going to do this a few times to your own rhythm. Inhale, arch. Exhale, push it back, rounding through the back. Let's do it one last time. Now come back to neutral position, feet flat on the floor. Now lift your right arm and you're going to pass it in the hole that your body is creating. And you want to come put your shoulder on the floor if possible, so you're twisting your upper body. Focus on breathing in this position because it's a twisting position and might be hard. Come back and now let's do it on the other side. So left hand pass through, trying to rest the shoulder on the floor. It might not be possible depending on your flexibility, but just go where you can, listening to your own body. On the next exhale, come back. And now walk your hands forward. Look in between your hands, bring your hips up. Intense shoulder stretch here. Your chest might be resting on the floor, or it might not, depending on your flexibility. But the important is that it stretches your shoulder and upper back. Slowly unroll vertebra per vertebra. Great. Let's now come back to a laying position. Bring your knees towards you. And now give yourself a little swing so you can pass your leg over your head. Here you can have straight leg or bent leg. Use your hands to support your back. Here again, focus on your breathing. Slowly unroll to come back to a sitting position. Let's now stand up. For this posture, you can use a block or simply do it on the floor. This is going to depend on your flexibility. You can use it horizontal or vertical. So, bringing your legs away from each other, putting your hands on the block or on the floor, and now we're going to lift one hand up, gaze is following the hand, twisting in the upper body. Keeping the legs straight and arms straight. On the next exhale, bring it down and open on the other side. Come back to the middle and lift your hand from the floor. And now we're just going to rock from one side to the other, bending the legs, trying to release the lower back, upper back area. And unrolling vertebra per vertebra. So whenever you feel tension in your upper body, do this routine and you are sure to feel better.